Hi everyone, welcome to this week's edition of this video log thing. Video blog, whatever you want to call it. Anyway, I hope everyone is well. Slowly I'm going to spin, stop spinning. This chair is really squeaky, I need to fix it. I'm sorry. So if it squeaks, I apologize. I've been trying to get it fixed for a while. I just keep forgetting until I do one of these videos and I notice it again. Earlier today, I went for a walk, hence why my hair is a disaster. Not that it's ever nice, like it, I've tried everything. It just hates me. I'm pretty sure. But today it was really, uh, it's rainy and stuff. So my hair's like, hey rain, let's be frizzy. Okay. I went and I took my camera out for the first time because I've been waiting. I didn't want to take it out in the bitter cold and it been raining. And today was finally like, blam, let's go take some photos. I went to the park. There was a car fire. As, as I got to the park, the fire was just kind of starting and then all the, it wasn't a big deal. It was in someone's garage, but it was just random. I'm like, oh, car fire. Let me take some pictures of some fire trucks. I, I hope you're all having a wonderful week. It's Wednesday, by the way, if you didn't know. Well, at least I'm filming this one and it gets uploaded. It could be Thursday, it could be next Wednesday, who knows? Maybe I'll upload it next Wednesday and then it'll all make sense because it'll still technically be Wednesday. Just a different Wednesday. Yeah. Unfortunately, I do not have the TARDIS mug because I started making coffee and then realized I didn't have it and I'm like, I'm not going upstairs to get it. So we got this one. Pretty sure this mug is as old as I am. It looks like a yard sale mug. You know those ones you find at yard sales? I love yard sales. I can't wait for spring so I can go yard sailing just so I can cr create this amazing collection of just random mugs. It's my goal to have the best, when I move out, best mug collection ever. That's a good goal, right? That's a good goal to have in life. No? So a while back I did a video called Awkward Moments. Um, I, Awkward Moments. Recently I've been noticing that I've had this reoccurring awkward moment that I'm pretty sure you can all relate to. You know the awkward eye contact? You make eye contact with someone and you're like, oh. It keeps happening to me at work all the time. I'll like look up and then, cause whatever I'm doing, people are like interested to see what am I cutting. So they'll be looking at me and I'll just happen to look up and then there's eye contact and then my face doesn't know what to do. It's just like, Ugh. most of the times this happens. That's my face. That's my reaction to them looking at me. There's one guy at work specifically that I swear to God is just always staring at me. He's an older guy, like not old. Okay, when I say older, I mean he's older than me. He's not ancient and 30's not old. 40's not old. 50's not even really old. Like 70 might be old. But anyway, um, he's a very nice guy, but I just, I swear I'll be doing something, I'll look up and he'll be, he'll be pulling like a, a cart or something and he'll be looking at me and my eyes will lock his and I'm like, oh God, I don't want to do my face again. But I love awkward moments because they are hilarious. And if you don't embrace the awkward moments, you just get embarrassed and then you feel bad about yourself. But instead, when you have an awkward moment, you should be like, yes, awkward moment. And then like note it for later because they're funny and make a good story. Such as this guy at work that I keep making awkward eye contact with all the time. Uh, recently I tried to make guacamole. That was a couple days, it didn't go very well. Oh, too much onion and garlic. It just tasted like onion and garlic with avocado. I can cook, I swear. So after my walk taking photos today, my dad and I went for a walk just because this is the first nice day and I can't sit still and he can't sit still. So we're like, let's go for a walk, okay, yeah. In town, for some reason, we have, I don't know. I have to Google this, excuse me for a second. I'm Googling. We're trying to figure out if what you called a group of pigeons. And here there, there's a couple different ones, but let's go with the flock. I was calling them a crew of pigeons because they were in a group and I'm assuming they're the only pigeons in town. There's only one group of pigeons in this town and they all hang out together and they all hang out in the same place all the time. I always see them on this certain stretch of hydro wire and they're over a sidewalk and it's just, they actually have me a little nervous because they're just chilling out and then they do, they do like a um, reconnaissance and they go out and they swoop and they do a big circle and they come back and it's like they're up to something. Them and their crew of pigeons, yo. But they're in like high traffic area. And like the one day I was like walking, I'm like, do to do. I'm like, why is there a lot of bird poop? Like a lot. And then I like look up and they're all like above my head. I'm like, oh my God. And I ran. But anyway, this is getting out of hand and I've been rambling for far too long. So I don't know if you can notice in this video, but my desk is significantly shorter than last time. I just lowered my chair. Anyway, I've talked for far too long. Well, have an amazing and amazing. That sounds weird. And amazing. Oh, who's that? And amazing. <laughs> wow. I should just go back to bed or something. But I'm going now for sure. So I hope you enjoyed this stupid video. And I will uh, talk to you the next time I make one of these. Bye.